and forth, there is a final place for a historical monument in Franklin County. It will honor black soldiers who fought in the Civil War. 70 of those soldiers were born in Franklin County. WDBJ 7's Amir Massenberg tells us why they decided to place it at a local church. I'm here at First Baptist Church on Franklin Street, and right here where I'm standing is where that monument is supposed to go, hopefully catching more attention. Scrapping the original plan, having a seven-foot-tall granite and bronze monument stand in the Veterans Memorial Park in Franklin County. But that's not a highly visible, highly trafficked site. It's kind of out of the way. With plans now underway for it to stand outside of the vacant First Baptist Church. President of the NAACP of Franklin County calling its new home the perfect spot. I think the black church has played such a major role uh, and continues to play a major role in bringing the, the races together and the communities together. And that's part of our education, telling this story. Pastor Chris Coates saying the church started in 1882 by a group of slaves. Years later, being used as a civil rights base for movements, including voter registration, protest, and integration in schools. We want to ensure that the story of social progress is always told. These 70 soldiers from Franklin County um, decided to display gallantry and um, they forsook all that they knew to go fight for a cause that was so very worth it. Now in the process of renovating the church for it to become a one-stop educational spot to learn African American history. The monument being the first thing people see and learn about before coming inside. I believe that the stories are intertwined and so I, I think the fact that a monument has the placement at a historically African American church, um, I just think that speaks to uh, the resilience uh, of a people. The hope is that the monument will be here standing by December of 2025 in Franklin County, Amir Massenburg, WDBJ7.